69-year-old Carlos watches the steady hand of sharpshooting contestants participating in the Summer Olympics. For this Colombian, a steady pulse was also an important part of his work as a carpenter and painter. But three years ago, his life changed, starting with an accident. While bowling, I threw a ball, and the next day I felt pain. I spent one year in physical therapy, going to 500 different sessions, and the pain didn't go away. His doctor later diagnosed him with the chronic and progressive movement disorder known as Parkinson's disease. The cause is unknown, and there's presently no cure, only treatment through medication and surgery that can lessen the symptoms. I have difficulty tying my shoes and brushing my teeth. Any movements with my hands are difficult because it feels heavy and rigid. There is trembling, rigidity and heaviness in my legs when I walk. Local health officials recommended that Carlos meet with Colombian neurosurgeon William Contreras. In 2013, Dr. Contreras developed an app that claims to ease the difficulty in walking produced by Parkinson's. I feel like marching. Through music, the app helps the patient release dopamine, a chemical substance that sends messages to parts of the brain that controls movement and coordination. The death of these dopamine neurons is what produces the symptoms of Parkinson's disease. The creators of the app called Listen Me tested the technology on patients in Germany, Colombia and Brazil. Although they claim further studies are needed in order to clarify and maximize its benefits, the initial results showed that auditory cues could help improve the patient's walking speed, cadence and stride length by 20 to 45 percent. I feel so good, doctor. I feel positive energy. Dr. Contreras says the app can't reverse severe symptoms presented during the most advanced stages of Parkinson's. But patients like Carlos, who are at the initial stages of the disease, have the most to benefit from the app, as it can help slow the progression of rigidity. I feel young and the need to run. Like I used to feel when I ran, jumped and danced. I feel those spectacular sensations and I want to walk faster. The creator says he hopes to reach the 200,000 Parkinson's patients in Colombia like Carlos Mejia and improve their lives one step at a time.